Hey guys, it's Jade and welcome back to another video on my channel. So, sorry I've been a little MIA. It doesn't probably feel like that to y'all, but I actually missed an upload last week. I usually upload two times a week. I got my wisdom teeth out. You can still kind of see the bruising a little bit on this side. Um, and it's been a little over a week, like one day over a week since I got them out. Um, honestly, recovering pretty well, but I haven't really been able to film and talk that much. Uh, so just throwing an apology out there right off the bat. But in today's video, as you guys can probably tell by the title above, we are actually going to be going back to school clothing shopping. So I've been so, so, so excited to do this video, um, but I've been waiting for my last paycheck from my internship to come in because I've been saving pretty much everything I've been earning into my savings account this summer. But I told myself, I was like, your very last paycheck, when that comes in, sis, go wild, go get you some goodies. I don't want to spend like every single dime I made in my last paycheck, um, but I do want to let myself get some fun things for the new school year. So I thought I would bring you guys along for the process and make a little shopping vlog out of it. The outfit today is very casual. Um, I kind of look like a hot mess, but again, this is like the first time I've even gotten semi-ready post-wisdom teeth. Um, so my necklaces are from Princess Polly. This shirt, which my hair is kind of covering, hold on. <laughs> This little graphic t-shirt is also from Princess Polly. This little zip up is from Walmart, love her. Um, these cute little like terry cloth shorts are from Aerie. They're just really pretty light sage green color. And then of course my little Reebok classic sneakers. I love these. Um, these are my off-white ones so they kind of match like the off-whiteness of this jacket, you know? I had a little moment, had a little thing. But I'm super excited to bring you guys along. I am packing up my bag right now and I actually get a lot of questions about this bag. I know you can't really see it well in this clip, hold on. So this bag, that I use a lot. It's just a little kind of a nylon tote bag. I get a lot of questions on what this is, where it is, where I got it. Um, this is actually a Longchamp bag. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but it's L-O-N-G-C-H-A-M-P. So Longchamp, Longchamp, whatever you want to call her. It's kind of um, the basic Brentwood PTO mom vibe, but you know what? I'm kind of here for it. And I actually ended up getting mine from TJ Maxx. I would not have bought one full price probably, um, but I just remember being at TJ Maxx a couple of years ago, seeing it there, literally the exact one that I wanted that was the black and like the larger tote size. Um, and so I just had to snag her. So for any of you that have wondered, that bag is a long shot bag and I got it from TJ Maxx. Hi babies. <laughs> Hi mojito, come here baby. All right, guys, so I just got in the car. Um, we're in Beep Beep the Jeep today. Love her, she's a queen. And I think we're actually going to go downtown to go shopping today. As you guys know, I live right outside of Nashville. Um, it's not really that big of a trek to go downtown, um, but sometimes I stay more around here, sometimes I go downtown. Today we're gonna go downtown. I actually first have to go get some paperwork filled out for my nursing school from one of my doctors that is in Nashville. Um, if you guys didn't know, I have arthritis juvenile ankylosing spondylitis to be exact. And I need my doctor to sign off on a form for nursing school for me, so I need to go do that before they close. Um, that's why we're kinda in a rush this morning. Afternoon, it's like two. But after that, I think I might hit up my favorite thrift liquidation store. You guys know, Buffalo Exchange. I find the best stuff there. I think I might also go to the Opry Mills Mall. They've got like a really good Forever 21 that has everything and I haven't bought or been to a Forever 21 in I feel like years, so might do that. Or I might go the other route, and I might go to Zara that is in the Green Hills Mall and go the more bougie route. It just depends if I feel like I'm spending money or like being a little bit more like economically effective. We will see where the day takes us. But for now, I'm gonna be driving downtown to go get my paperwork signed and jamming out along the way. All right guys, so I just made it downtown to my doctor's office. I'm gonna go run in and get this form signed and then we'll figure out where we're gonna go next. So form assigned and all sorts of stuff like that. And I actually noticed as I was driving down the street to go to my next location, which I think is gonna be at Buffalo Exchange, one of my favorite thrift stores, you guys know this. I literally in every shopping vlog, I feel like I go there. <laughs> um, I actually noticed this really cool new mural. So I wouldn't be a good, um, influencer if I didn't stop and see if I get some cute bags because I think it's so cute. So I parked in this little lot that it doesn't look like I have to pay to park and hopefully I don't get like towed or anything. I'm only gonna be here for like literally two minutes so I think it's gonna be fine. Um, and we're gonna go see if we can get any cute pics. If I did, I'll insert them in the video or they'll be on Insta. Love that for us. Okay, I'm going. 
So I just parked um, near Buffalo Exchange. Um, I just realized that I think that they have free parking, but I'm just parallel parking, so it's fine. It's gonna take like a couple quarters. I'm gonna live. I actually also just noticed across the street um, a really cute parking garage who like potentially could get some pics there as well. The pictures that I took at the other place were like, eh, I may have insert a couple like right now, kind of to the side over here. I just feel like I just couldn't find anywhere to like set up my phone. Of course, like I don't have anyone else with me, so I have to take a good self timer pick. I didn't have anywhere to really put my phone to make a nice angle. Um, and the lighting was kind of weird, so eh, but maybe when I edit them, they'll look cute. I don't know. I might run up over to this parking garage here. I'll show you guys real quick. See, it's just right there. I don't know why I've never noticed it, but I kind of like the print on it. And then I was like, wait, I wonder if it has a good view of the city from the top. It's not that tall, but we could try um, and see if we can get some pics there. And then if not, and that's like a fail, I'm just gonna go to Buffalo Exchange and we will actually do what you came to this video to see which is clothing shop for back to school. All right, you guys, I don't even know, is this recording? I can't even tell. So I made it to the top of the parking garage. It's actually really cool because there is graffiti like everywhere and in the stairwells, it's just this whole big rainbow thing. So that was really cool. But I made it to the top and y'all, this place is beautiful. I just had to whip out the vlog camera and show you guys. Hold on. Look at this beautiful city. It's kind of a fun area of Nashville. It's not necessarily like right in the middle of downtown or anything. This is Elliston Place right here uh, that you guys are seeing, but this is kind of what this place looks like. Really cool. I definitely am gonna save this location in um, my phone so I can come back and have more like real photo shoot type beat things happening here and maybe bring some friends here and take some cute pictures. Always trying to find new locations and I found a new one. So fun, love it. I'm speechless, literally speechless. I just bought literally $300 worth of clothing from a thrift store. My mind is absolutely blown. I also didn't get a parking ticket, thank God, even though I was probably about like 20 minutes late on my parking meter. 
But y'all, I mean, I got Levi's jeans, two pairs of Lululemon shorts, two for Love and Lemons dresses for like my formals I'll have in the fall. For my sorority, I got two different Madewell sweaters, another really cute sweater, this like adorable Zara tote that is also filled with clothes, and a pair of white Nike running shoes that were literally brand new with the tags never been put on someone's foot. Like, sis i think the lord just really wanted me to have a good shopping day today and i did in fact do that like i almost like literally don't want to go anywhere else because i already spent so much money a more than i thought i would spend today b already found so much like i'm actually in shock i honestly want to film like a tiktok haul for some of these things while I'm chilling in my vehicle because it was just that good of a day. I just can't believe it. And I'm not, I don't ever really do things on TikTok. I also just noticed there's a pair of sneakers hanging from that light pole. I'm not usually a TikTok hauler, but I was like, you know what? This might be too good of a day to not do a TikTok haul for it. Anyways, I'm gonna sit here and debate this and I'm gonna check in with you guys when I make my decision on what to do next. All right guys, so as you guys can see, I actually did decide to come home. I had already just found so many good things that my fill of shopping was absolutely full and I was very satisfied with everything that I got. Um, and the only reason I would have kept going is just solely to put more content that was shopping in this vlog. <clears throat> and I realized that that was not a good reason to spend money. <laughs> so um, I am home. I literally have all my stuff. I can show you guys on the floor right here. Like so much cute stuff. Um, the next video that will be coming out on my channel should be a back to school clothing haul of all of these items plus a bunch of other stuff that I have been accumulating. I'll show you a preview of a couple of the other items that are gonna be in the haul. This sweater is free people, also from Buffalo Exchange. This sweater was from Buffalo Exchange. I think it's, is it Topshop? Something like that. Cute little Nike moment. Like lots of just super more free people. Really cute stuff plus other things that are not from Buffalo Exchange obviously that I bought from normal stores. Um, that I still need to pull out. I actually think I'm gonna sit down and film that haul right now while I'm in the mood. But I wanted to hop on here and just thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you guys are new, make sure to subscribe to my channel down below as well as give this video a big thumbs up if you like these shopping vlogs. I know these shopping vlogs are very different than my normal vlogs because you know, obviously in a normal vlog, I would be showing you my entire day. Whereas in these videos, I really only show you um, me shopping and an OTD and what I end up getting at the end um, without too many spoilers, of course, because you gotta watch the haul for that. Um, so if you like these videos, give them a big thumbs up and let me know in the comment section down below. <laughs> Make sure to go over and follow me on Instagram. It's just at Jade Benward. That is where you will see all these pieces styled and cute little posts. I actually think that I will be putting a post together with some pics that I took today. Um, especially loved the ones that I got on top of that parking garage. Very glad I ended up walking up there. Um, so make sure to go over and find that picture and like it and leave me a comment letting me know that you guys actually watched the vlog, that those pictures were taken in. But I think that's going to be it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching it and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.